Hey yo brother, what's up, what's going on, I hope you are all fine. In this video, I'll show you when uh, what you can do when your LD player is stuck on 50%. As here you can see my brother have a question. Uh, I like this because I want to play Blockman Go but it's stuck at 50%. And also he have mentioned here some about upgrade to OpenGL. So if you want to upgrade your OpenGL, then definitely you need to uh, upgrade your graphic drivers and if you don't know i'm just showing you if you know that's great but if you, in case if you don't know or some other people are also watching this so if they don't know then click here device manager and then you can see a display adopters now you will get here two drivers sometimes you will get one but in my case i'm getting two here one is intel id graphic that's mean my built-in gpu and the second one is nvidia geforce gtx 610 that's mean the external graphic card so if you have external graphic card then right click on that upgrade drivers and search for uh, search automatically for drivers this is the best way to upgrade your graphic drivers now uh, in case if you don't have then you can go with the upper one option that's the way okay now let's move on the uh, stuck now you can see here my ld player is stuck at 50 percent let's fix this issue first of all let me close this you don't need to repair it okay just close it and now this time you need to type here the control panel once you type this you will get control panel open it now here you need to go into the program sections and turn windows features on or off just go over there you will get here in a small window now here you need to type uh, turn off the hyper v if it's already that's great but in case if it's not then turn it off now the second option is virtual machine platform you need to turn this option off as well windows hypervisor platform turn this option off and uh, windows sandbox these four options are important you need to turn off all these options once you have done this you need to restart your pc once now it's saying restart your pc so i'm stopping here my recording uh, i'm just so finally i have restarted my pc as you can see my applications are still running now i'm gonna start my ld player here is it now let's see so as you can see now it's working fine it's going on so this is the way guys you can fix your ld player and if you have still any question then just drop your comment now uh, i'm also recommending you if you are facing a lot even a lot of issues um occurs in ld player so i'm highly recommending you if you are using the low-end operating system uh, sorry computer or laptop then go with the nox player that works super fine without having any issue you can just play games on the uh, nox player but i'm not uh, saying that uh, you will get a proper performance like without lagging or shuttering definitely if you have low requirement you will face a lot of issues on your ld player uh, sorry nox player any emulator but uh, yeah in some cases nox player is more best and more uh, you know the comfortable the optimized emulator uh, for your operating system i'm using ld player because now i have uh, a lot of counts activated on my ld player and uh, the insta the whatsapp and gmail so it's take a lot of times for me to move on another emulator so that's why i'm using ld player in case if uh, by chance i just delete this ld player then definitely i'll go next time on nox player because i have experienced all the emulators the nox player the blue stock the mimo and a uh, lot of other ld player uh, emulators are available i have tried uh, all emulators and um, what i have found the nox player is so comfortable and uh, working so smooth than the other sem other emulators but in case uh, if you have a better um, you know the requirement then blue stock is more better than the nox these both emulators are awesome i'm recommending you anyways my video is now and uh, see you in the next video till then just stick yourself a la face bye bye